The idea that someone would actually vote illegally with the penalties that are in place. Uh, it happens know, all the time, Senator. It happens all the time. You You're just saying it's not widespread. But I'm saying we don't know how spread it is because we don't detect it. You, I'm on the website for the state of California to register to vote. On the section that has where you put in your driver's license, your last four of your social, there's a box underneath each one that says, I don't have one. I don't have one. And then you're allowed to proceed to go to vote. So this idea that you're not allowed to register to vote unless you present some sort of identification is not accurate. It's not true. It's not being implemented in the state of California. Additionally, people are being registered to vote at the DMV. And we already know, based on audits, that the DMV has improperly registered people to vote, including illegal immigrants. And we have immunity in place that says if the DMV registers someone who is not eligible, they're immune for prosecution. So I, I don't believe we have sufficient safeguards in place that detect and prevent people from committing voter fraud.